So I've been working on this truck quite a bit. Things are going pretty good. All the fluids have been changed. I love these old N600s. Took the old grain bed off. Putting on a wooden side bed. Been working on this gate. Made it to where it slides open pretty good. Got a couple little latches that keep it from coming out, but all this comes off when you're trying to load from the side, this and that. If you just make it to where it comes off easy, life is easy. But that's not what we're doing today. We're not working on this. We got a job to do, so let's put her to work. Let's get to it. All right, well, we made it safely. Both machines, track loader. Oh man, there's that good looking truck again. Woo. Well, let's take a look at what we're moving. All right, so my customer, long time ago, him and his dad built a fire pit and his dad passed away. So about four or five years ago, we built this pallet and we stored this several years ago. It's a heavy sucker. I don't remember it being this large. I'll have to take all this stuff off. I don't think my two machines can pick it up on its own. But I made these skids and everything and Last time I used my Mahindra tractor and my little SSV 65 skid steer, but this should be interesting. All right, let's uh, let's get this thing yanked out of here. So I'm going to try to do some voiceover. So what I'm doing here, we figured we'll just pull as much weight out of this fire pit as possible. I thought it was going to be easy, but these the Tupperware totes, they were dry rot and they were the, they were starting to fall apart. So I had to be pretty careful with them. Uh, they were very, very heavy. Now I thought, well, let's get as much weight out of here as possible. Uh, I shouldn't have too much difficulty lifting them. Stop! Back up! So we got out what we could. I I couldn't believe how heavy this thing was. Now, you don't see it, but we tried lifting the fire pit with both of these machines uh, to place it on the flatbed. But it was just a little too much weight for my little SSV-65. Um, it was scaring my dad a little bit because it started to tip forward. I think it would I think it would have been all right. So we decided to take more weight out. I think these Tupperware, they probably had to weigh at least three or 400 pounds each. And we took out as many bricks and whatnot as we could. And at this point we thought, well, let's get into position, see if we can't lift it. And you can see the back wheel is starting to come up. It was a little tippy. The 75 was doing just fine, but my little tire machine, it was struggling, but she did it.
Well, I gotta say that went pretty smooth. It's a little heavy for that other machine, but we took some weight out. Worked out pretty good, so now we just gotta get strapped down. We'll haul it down, so let's get on down there. If you're enjoying these videos, hit that like button, subscribe, post a comment. Billions of people are missing this and they need to watch my videos because they're amazing. Thanks for watching. This is the final resting place for this fire pit. I'm gonna do a little cleanup here, but my battery's starting to run low. But I still got a few more buckets to bring up. But anyways, it'll be a nice little, there's a big open spot right here. I'm gonna get this situated and call it good. But other than that, thanks for watching. On to the next job.